Hello friends, today we're going to wire in a wireless rain sensor, Hunter rain sensor, into an X2 controller. Now I've already done this, so we're, I'm just going to go back and kind of show you what I did. Uh, and they're very, very simple. So follow along, I'm sh assuming this will be a pretty quick video. <laughs> Thanks. Alright, as you can see, you got X2 here. Um, got a video on how to install that, easy, easy peasy. And this is the receiver for the Hunter wireless Hunter RAN sensor. Um, and what we do actually now, um, there's a knockout right here. We put in a, it's called a strain relief connector. Um, there's also, we before we put in a clamp, uh, cable clamp connector, whatever. But those have a little bit of a hole in them, so you get, then you get all sorts of wasps and yellow jackets and things in there. So this just seals it up nice so nothing can crawl up there and make a home out of it. Um, so I just took the yellow wires from the receiver. Oh, so I need to tighten that up. And wired this into the AC unit. And then the blue and white wires just go right into the sensor terminal. And then once you do that, you will hit the manual test spindle and hold that down for five seconds. And then it will, um, this will turn green. Um, but right now, I've already got this on and we've gotten rain, so it's actually shutting off and doing what it's supposed to do. And then, yeah, just uh, go mount this up on the eave or whatever and get to go. Oh, you also want to hit, have this on. <laughs> hit your switch to on. So it actually will not bypass the sensor. And here's where we mounted it. It's on the back of the house. And I'm going to go up there and see if I got the same level. Alright, here we are. Up on the ladder. Let's see what happens there. Pretty close. 